Alright guys, welcome back to a challenge map that ZigZag has just put up today. And oh boy, I am recording this after and this is, this has got to be possibly the hardest map on GeoGuessr. And I'm not just saying that, you will see. When you watch this video, you will see. Now be prepared to see some bad, bad guesses. But let me tell you something, that title is not clickbait. This does not go how you expect. I need to say again, this map is so hard. Enjoy our suffering. Okay, and this one's an NPZ, so all we have is this shot. I'm gonna say Argentina, and that's all. That's Hawaii. Wow, wild. All right, on to round two. Okay, this one, I don't like this because it feels too familiar, but I actually think that this is like England, which is kind of good because we haven't had any, we haven't had anything in the UK. This just kind of feels like something around here. I'll, I'll send it, I'll send it in England. So here we go. What? Oh, this is Russia. Really? Wow. One good guess. Okay, round three. Ooh, okay. Mm. This is so difficult. Obviously, that's the whole point, but like, this wall here, it's giving me nothing. It's giving me maybe Europe. I think that the sun is in the south. You can see the shadow coming in from this way, which would be uh, south, coming from south. So that puts us in the northern hemisphere. So we, we're probably in Europe somewhere. Somewhere that's got these old, old stone walls, like maybe like, could be Ireland. But I'm thinking that we go like Romania. Never, never, ever was I going Canada on that. Wow. It's the guy that built this map. Unbelievable. Shout out to you. Okay, last round. NMPZ is so crazy here. Okay. I'm actually going to say... Just on this tiny bit of building here, I'm gonna say you're in Japan. I'm gonna to click Tokyo. We're gonna get 4,700 and we're gonna get 5,000 points total. Let's see it. I can't believe we finished with Melbourne, Australia. Is this Albert Park? Yeah, I mean, I've literally been here. It's crazy. That's crazy. Whoo! Oh, we've got one round left. We've got one round left. Okay. <clears throat> we've got three points on that. That one's going to drive Zigzag crazy as well. There's no way that he knows that that's Australia. Okay. See, these are just like your classic... Um, in my mind, at least, in my mind, this is your classic Southeast Asian um, kind of greenery here. Like, could be Thailand, could be Cambodia, could be in any of these countries here is what I'm thinking. That, these, this is eucalyptus trees, I think, which is interesting. It, it looks like it could be Australia again as well. I am going to say Thailand here. And I don't have a better, I just don't know. That's literally it. I have no clue, except for that foliage kind of looks in that part of the world. And that is Kenya, nine points on the board. That is 322 total. We officially have the worst score, the worst score I've ever had in this game by a long shot. 
All right, let's see how Oscar goes in this. Let's see how Zigzag goes. Let's go, NMPZ. We're allowed to look at the car this time though. And we start off here with, okay, 2019 copyright. Okay, I have some ideas here. I feel like this looks really Caribbean, almost like Puerto Rico, British Virgin Islands, maybe North Colombia, Curacao. Kind of reminded me of those places the most. It is weird, but I think this almost looks like a European style sign. So either we're over in Europe and I'm uh, miscalculating things, or maybe this is actually just I didn't even see there was a sign there. Curacao, as part of the Netherlands. I mean, it's not out of the question to me. I, I can definitely see that. It, the camera's also a bit hazy, which you tend to see in Curacao. The problem is though, the Google car seems to be wrong, in my opinion, I think so. In fact, it's wrong for all the Caribbean places apart from Colombia. So maybe I have to reconsider here. Cause I think, yeah, the blur is too wide. These concrete blocks on the side of the road, I did not know what's going on here, man. Some kind of a car park. The, the Google car blur has really taken me away from this idea. It's still the idea I like the most. Most. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just impossible. Nah, I do not know where this is. Maybe this sign over here slightly feels European. That was one of the ideas why I liked Curacao, but given that the car blows wrong, do we ever try a Bulgaria or a Romania or something like that? It would be crazy if we were right. I just don't think the color of the dirt feels particularly European. Like Europe tends to have more neutral dirt colors than this being very dark. Maybe Brazil, I, I'm, I'm actually just stumped here. I, I do not know where this is. I, I have some kind of a vibe off the trees, but it's not enough to get the right answer i think so we have to just guess here oh i hate this feeling we were in argentina let's see where oscar goes wait you just want to guess you want to hit guess but you just don't have a good place to hit guess on so what about southern see africa it. see southern africa might make more sense than anything i've thought of here i'm just gonna go for that i don't think it's bulgaria i'm gonna go for johannesburg ah oh, it's so wrong let's go ah oh. Hawaii. Makes sense. Dark dirt. So kind of volcanic-ish. Apart from that, it doesn't really, uh, I, don't, I don't really know. It's, it's a similar climate, to be fair. Similar kind of latitude to the Caribbean. Similar climate in some ways. It makes enough sense. We're 19,100 kilometers away. Our guess in South Africa is almost the direct antipode to there. That's as bad as we possibly could have started. Next one. Okay. This is the Phillip Island. Uh, not Phillip Island. This is the Albert Park Australia guess. Does... Zigzag, no, Australia. Because I don't, apparently. Here. Houses off to the left and infrastructure off to the left could be Australian. Another thing I considered, this kind of feels like your average bait round in Argentina, uh, uh, Buenos Aires, maybe. I could see that. Yeah, so I'm kind of between Australia and uh, Argentina and Brazil here, I would say. It looks like we've got a golf course off to the right there. I mean, the way they're doing these cages around the taps does look very Australian to me. I don't really identify any city that this would be in. If it was Australia, it's probably Sydney. I'm pretty certain it's not Adelaide. If it is Adelaide, I'm going to be kicking myself. I'll tell you that much. Because I feel like I would have walked this trail if it was Adelaide. So yeah, Buenos Aires, I think. Uh, sun there, a little bit north. So that, that actually does fit. And apart from that, I think that's about my entire thought process. I just think it looks kind of like Buenos Aires. Very modern buildings, but you know, Buenos Aires is a rich city in its own right. Gonna go to downtown. Maybe now that I scanned a bit, feeling worse. I'm just really hoping this is not Australia. It does look like Australia though. I'm going Buenos Aires. I don't care. Oh my gosh, it's Melbourne. Does Zigzag know Australia? No. Do I know Australia? No. I went Japan. He goes Argentina. But what did I say? I said Sydney probably, didn't I? Yes. No, Melbourne makes sense, man. Me, sir. There we go. Again, zero pointer. Right latitude, at least. They're the same latitude, Buenos Aires and, and Melbourne. Next one here, immediately California vibe. Interesting fence. Options like, like Chile as well, maybe. Northern Spain could be an interesting thought here. Colombia, maybe. Yeah, Chile, Colombia, US, Spain. I think the, the fence feels very South American. I can't believe how hard this map is. If you guys remember, this one was in Russia. And Zigzag just rattled off about 10 countries and none of them are Russia. I went, I went the UK. Uh, probably not trustworthy on a bait map, you know? What about it? What about California? I really do quite like that. The road feels kind of American to me, the way it's so pale and, and speckly. I do kind of vibe with this, this guest still. Very interesting tree. I'm not really sure I recognize that for the US though, but hopefully it's just like a West Coast only species. Second option would be Chile, I think. So let me go in here. I would go um like oh my Clarf, gosh. Um, which is right on the north border of California. Ah, Russia. Okay, well, well. Zigzag is three from three here with zero points on the board. Do we have a chance of beating him? We got 300. Feels big now. Feels really big now. Well, this was a difficult one. That does make sense. Although out of all the ones Holy I think that makes sense for in this video. Count it, take a shot every time. Oh, next one. Interesting fence here. Obviously would remind you of Europe, but is that the bait? Okay, it is.
Spoiler, it is. I went Romania here. We're saying it's not Europe, maybe Korea, maybe USA. I mean, Sun seems to be more so to the south here, I would say. So Northern Hemisphere, that does conform with every thought I've had so far. Definitely looks Northern Hemisphere. Road almost feels Asian, which is interesting. So not too sure what I'm making of that. Maybe that could be a Korean house. I'm really struggling to see what's going on with that. I don't mind the Korea idea. I think Korea is better than the United States, at least. I think if I was just going for the standard guess in Europe, probably like Croatia, Italy, probably Italy maybe would be my main idea here. But you know, we're ballers here, man. We're, we're gonna go Korea and we're gonna be very far away. Let's go, let's go. Oh, wow. Victoria, BC. Three points. Is that our first points of the scene? I think it is. 8,000. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. Once again, like I said, no one is ever going Canada on that. That is crazy. And killing me as a way. Makes sense. It was North America. The North America idea was better there. Okay, last round here. Let's lock in and get this correct. I think whatever it is, if I get it wrong, I'm going to be kicking myself because this is familiar. Mexico is always a safe option when you have zero clue and the species are completely foreign looking to you. Could be Indonesia. Could be. So this one we went Thailand on. Uh, I can't remember where it was, but I think we got also got zero points on this round. Um, so let's see. Where zigzag ends up? Bangladesh. I can see Bangladesh working. Thailand, always a possibility on these rounds. Does not yeah. even look Mexican, which is a shame because I was going to go for that as my default guess. What is going on with this road? It could be like Taiwan or Hong Kong. That would just be, that would be crazy. I don't know, man. What do you even do, man? It could be Brazil too. It could be a lot of places, my bro. I don't really want to score three points on this seed. There is something distinct here. Oh, there's no way it's like around Mount Etna or in Italy or oh, I don't know, man. Like it could be Europe. It's a true mind bender. No, it's Lemon's maps. We're going into last last decision. <sighs> Kenya. Yeah, that makes sense. We beat Zigzag. Not only did we beat him in one round, we beat him in a full map, an impossible map, in fact. Oscar, eight points makes my three hundred look crazy. That's so crazy. Let's see what he has to say about that. And there we have it. We drew a lot of straight lines here. You can at least say that. The kind of latitude guessing was at least somewhat correct. But this was a tough challenge. There you go. Shout out Zigzag. Um, I've linked the video down below to watch his. And obviously, if you somehow haven't subscribed to him, subscribe to his stuff. He puts out the most amazing GIS content. And obviously, I think this is one of those ones where me knowing less actually helped because he had the ability to see and think about more things and it kind of probably misled him even more. But anyway, that was so fun and I actually can't believe how that worked out score-wise. That's actually crazy. Anyway, great times. Appreciate you guys so much. Hey, if you want to subscribe, click the button right now. Otherwise, click this guy right here. It's a video YouTube thinks you're going to like. I'll see you guys next time.